Hi everyone, it's Toy Tube here, and um, today um, I'm going to be reviewing <clears throat> the Swift Mystery. Just kidding. No, we, we are going to be reviewing. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> Not the Swift Mystery. The Swift Mystery is all the way up there. Anyways, um, today we're going to be reviewing the Skeleta Calaveras Monster High Holiday um doll. <laughs> doll. Wait, Day of the Dead doll. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Big brain. Okay. <laughs> but anyways, yeah, we're going to be unboxing her with Zoe. Hello. And, um, oh, jeez. Sorry. I thought it was only at 6% battery. Okay. <laughs> um, but anyways, um, so, yeah, I'm going to be, re we're going to be reviewing her. I'm kidding. Um, so, okay. So, yeah, um, we can, Okay. And in my last video, I so you guys would guess um which doll I'm which doll I'm doing next. And if you guys guessed Skeleta, then you're right. But the next one, if you think that the, my next review will be stitched in style Frankie, then like. But if you think it's the Cleo induced Valentine's set, subscribe. That was dangerous. Mm. Okay. Um. Anyways, time to review. So, first, her box has a bunch of skullettes and flowers and some candles and even some spiderweb details at the end. And the back of her box is really cute. We'll um, show that later. And then there's a bunch of these cute flags that, um, some butterflies, some skullettes, some more butterflies, some skullettes, and some more butterflies and skullettes. <clears throat> and, yeah. On the back of her mm. box, it has the stock picture of her. Um, she looks really cool and pretty in this. And, um, I'm not going to read her bio. This one is, I think, in Spanish. And this one, this one's in Spanish, this one's in English. Yeah, wait, did we do it? Yeah. Oh, I was looking at the top. Okay, <laughs> I'm actually... <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm going to... okay. I'm sorry, I'm going to... It's gonna... only a box. I'm sorry, I'm okay. going to, I'm going to review her now. Mm-hmm. I mean... We only did... waited two minutes and 22 okay. seconds. Okay, warm and sweet at... I'm not going to... I did it. <laughs> I reviewed. I, I okay. I I'm sorry. Maybe we'll do it at the end of the video. We'll read it. But you know what? I'm gonna do that. Warm and sweet as I arrange a traditional marigold headpiece in my hair. N my mommy put. I can't. Um. I don't well, know I don't how they. I don't know anything. how. Yeah. I don't want to mispronounce anything. And also, I don't know how they say that. Like, it's the like M-I and then M-A-M-I. So, I don't really know how they pronounce that. I just said my mommy, but, you know, it could be different. So, no, no, time no. to open. So, Zoe, you can talk about this. Okay, doll. so, there are, actually, it was really cool. So, to the, this year, Monster High released two holiday dolls. Um, it, we have the Skeleta here um, for Dave the Dead and then Claudine for just, uh, um, like... Uh, Christmassy, wintery. It's winter solstice um, for a holiday. So here we have Skeleta. And it's actually really nice that they brought back her character. Wait, wait, what? Skeleta. What was that? <laughs> it's really nice that she brought. They brought back her character because we don't. Because I mean, I. I mean, she wasn't the biggest character, but like you know, some people really enjoyed her character. I mean, I enjoyed her. I thought she was good when she was introduced in the Scaris movie. Yeah. What's cool about this doll is she's a skeleton. So, like, she has very skeleton features. If you look closely at her hands, they're, like, skeleton features. Her arms are, like, skeleton bones. And you can say about Scaris, too. Oh, yeah, 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 I love Scaris. So, in the Scaris, we got her original core core doll, which featured a Scaris suitcase, as it was the Scaris line, which she also got her friend... Um, Jennifer from, I forget where they say she was from, somewhere, <laughs> and, um, they both got their, I, I think it was Shanghai, yeah, well, actually, uh, yeah, I think it was Shanghai, but, like, it was something, some, like, pun yeah. of monsters, but I forget what it was, yeah. 
Yeah, I don't remember. Uh, so, and um, they both got their cord doll doll outfits, like classic outfits that you'd later see them in, with a nice addition of a suitcase. And Scalita's was a simple yet sweet dress, um, skirt dress. And she had her natural Sorry, makeup and face features, and of course her skeleton. And her suitcase Whoa. was a, a, she is fragile doll <laughs> was like a pink suitcase if i believe so yeah um, oh did i break her please tell me i didn't break her oh, oh no geez. i don't like that look oh my god i actually don't have any scolita dolls oh my god zoe i don't like that look this is it's so open i don't like it so here she is and her whole body if you didn't know, but it is a skeleton body. So she has her own Just mold that is a skeleton mold. And that is really cool. If you Can you please take out the stand? Oh, the stand's under here. Thank cool. you. Okay, so good. first I'm going to start with her Ooh. face. So she has all of these cool little patterns. And a certificate. And a certificate of authenticity. <laughs> and this little cool, cute stand. And we're, go we're bringing back the original. Yes, which I think this one was from 2016 from the g2 kind of um special edition um skeleta doll but anyways um here she has this pink lipstick and i mean lips and you can see like there's some lines in it and then she also has like these little stitches on each side and she also has like little painting details on her face like she has some like cool hearts and just like a bunch of different patterns and shapes and her eyes are brown like a light brown though and hazel. yeah like a hazel yeah there we go. and stand mm. it's the crouch stand i don't like those stands i broke my abby stand so easily like this part broke mm. <laughs> hopefully that doesn't happen with us yeah but yeah so her face isn't a skeleton face but i think it's cool that she doesn't have ears so technically this is an, um her own face mold because she doesn't have ears but it's not like a skeleton face like she still has eyes and lips oh my god if she didn't have eyes that would be creepy <laughs> um mm, okay so like her dress yeah <laughs> okay so first her hair is black with some blue in Ooh, it that's pretty yeah that's like a pretty cool. blue color like yeah like kind of like a greenish blue mm -hmm, i like that and yeah it goes down to here and she also i think this is the marigold headpiece that she was talking about and it has like these marigold flowers and some monster high skullettes <clears throat> that also match her face. I don't actually know if they're skeletons because they don't have the bows. But they kind of, but like, they kind of like that face paint that she has on her face, that mm -hmm. makeup. Yeah. Like those designs. I think that's the same as um, on that. <clears throat> on the skullet. Yeah. So, okay. So. Um. So, um. Yeah. So here is her dress. We got a lot of things to review about this. You can also help too. Okay. I like so, her dress. Yeah. <laughs> so the top Helpful. of her dress is like a black. I like these parts. This is like probably yeah. my favorite part of it. Like, um, <laughs> is like black with some gold and even like over here is some, has some gold. And she also has some puffy sleeves. Well, my not beauty. sleeves, but yeah. My beauty. And <laughs> they are purple and pink, which is really cute with some sparkles, you yes. know. And she also has this necklace that is, um, has a little blue skullet and some, a uh, pink and it's pink. I like the word skull. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then she has a dress that's also attached to her top. But, um, I mean, technically this is a skirt. But anyways, um, it's yeah. pretty too. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, so it has some more skulls. <laughs> yeah. In different colors, which I like. It goes against the black. It's like nice colors. Yeah. So it has black. like a bunch of skulls, even some spider web details, some butterflies i think some marigold flowers in there too and it's really pretty and it definitely brings out day of the dead and it's really pretty so on the bottom she also has some like almost like pink fishnet and they have some sparkles in it love it and then yeah and then some fabric that is purple with some more sparkles on it on the ends mm -hmm. she also has some bracelets on her skeleton hands which we'll get into in a minute we'll show you all of her body mm -hmm. like her and she also has some, if you want to skip that part, you can, but we just want to, like, show how different her body is. But, um, she also has some, um, some bracelets. There's, like, a blue one, a bluish-green one, um, an orange one, and a pink one. Adorable. 
And on the other side, she has um, an orange one, a pink one, and a purple one. I like the purple one. Okay, yeah. So, um, here is her shoes. They are brown and with some little marigold flowers that are, you know, orange. It's time for the body part. This one is going to be rough. Okay. This is her arm. I like it. I mean, I think it's like a cool design. It's skeleton-y. Yeah. This part kind of creeps me out. Oh, uh -huh, the crease. Like, <laughs> yeah. I know. Okay. Like, not in like, like I'm scared of it, but it's yeah. just like, kind of like, just mm, makes just me feel like, 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 ugh, like, gross. Mm -hmm. But anyways, I'm going to take off her dress for a minute so I can show you guys. Mm. I'm scared. <laughs> <gasps> her oh. rib cage. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, whoa. She is fragile. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. She, like... Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Just, I feel bad for this. Okay, so here's her rib cage. Oh, jeez. Which... Ugh. And her spine. Very oh, interesting. Mm-hmm. I don't know how. I mean, I know she's a skeleton, but... Spooky, scary skeleton. <laughs> okay. I mean, she's a nice character. Mm hmm Also, she's, like, really fragile. Like, look! It's like a gummy. Gummy? Wait, I don't like, look, gummy. like... Oh, my God, yeah. And then, also, this is her hands. Now, Ooh, like she gummies. also has this plastic. And then her legs are actually kind of freaking me out. Like, they're literally so skinny. Wait, that makes sense why that has a plastic thing. Because, like, if, if it was just against this, since it's so gummy, it would probably just, like, not be as big as the, yeah. they wanted the dress to be. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. And this doll, overall, we actually didn't, like, do, a, like, the full-on, really detailed review. But this doll does have a lot of small little details, and she is gorgeous. So, we can show the stand. Mm -hmm. So, on the bottom of the stand, it says 2016. But, um, so, so I think it might be the same stand they use for the 2016, um, like, uh, or 20, um, or 2017, yeah, uh, Skolita Special Edition, edition from G2. I, it might have been 2016, 2017. Mm -hmm. And, yep, it's a little stand with some little skelettes and some cute designs. And this is the crouch stand. I don't like these stands. They're too fragile, in my yeah, opinion. I call them crouch stands. I don't know what they're actually called. But, um, yeah, they're scoop just, like, stands. like, also, they don't really, is that actually what they're called? I don't know. And the scoop stands, we're gonna call them. Mm -hmm. But, the, you know, they just don't really, like, get her on there really well. I like the ones that go, like, around here. Mm -hmm. the, they bounce you know, better. The iconic Monster High stands. Mm -hmm. They bounce but better. we also have the back of the box. A bunch of little Oh, it's so cute pretty. Stuff. I know there's, like, a few, I think, hidden details. Like, from other Monster High dolls, I'm pretty sure, in here. But in the background, I'm, yeah. I just saw something suspicious. Hmm, never mind. Hmm. The scissors. I thought they were suspicious, but they're not. Don't worry, guys. I think that one of these things is what, um, is what she makes in art class. Wait! You guys can correct me if I'm wrong, but isn't this the thing that she made in art class? I forget. But this little pot... Is that the thing that she made in art class? I forget. I think? I, I mean, I know she was included in art class, obviously. And I'm pretty sure she made a pot or something, because I know Abby made an ice sculpture. And then Draculaura made, like, a like a thingy-majiggy. I don't know. I think it was a painting of herself. Self-obsessed. Wow. Just kidding. I'm, I'm kidding. But um, here is the Skolita Calaveras. This certifies that you, Monster High Holiday, Dia Duel Metos. I'm sorry Zoe if I'm can't. pronouncing that wrong. Zoe, Zoe can't speak. Calaveras doll materialized through the collaboration, collaborative efforts of designers and artists. Collaborative efforts mm -hmm. of designers and artists at Mattel. Yep, and I think it's also in Spanish too over here. Mm, cool. And it says certificate of authenticity. Thank you. Yes. And Monster High Holiday. So overall, what would you rate this doll out of ten? That's what I was gonna ask you. I'm gonna say a solid. Oh wait! Before we do that. We oh can... no 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 not the thigh, the thigh the thigh. <laughs> well, not exactly the thigh, but we need to bend her legs. That mm, not the best bend, but you know. 
Oh, yeah. After what, would, what would we rate? Honestly, a solid 8 out of 10. I mean, mm-hmm. her... Her, her, her spine is a little interesting, and I feel I mean, like that was on her original doll. Oh, yeah. we forgot to show her neck. Yeah. Very creepy. Also, I just feel like just an 8 out of 10, you know? Mm, I'm going to give her an I mean, 8 out of 10, too, just because I like her original Scaris doll better, but mm-hmm. I mean, honestly, who doesn't? Like, I yeah. mean... G3 is... No, just an obvious... In all ways, it's just not as good as G1. I feel like yeah. we can all agree on that. I just feel like they made it too much kiddish. I mean, like... I mean... I mean, like... I'm. Mean, it's good that it's inclusive. Yeah, but. yeah. Also, but, like, like, I feel like that they made the show a little bit too kiddish. Yeah. But the dolls are... They're solid, but, like, they're... Yeah. You know... You know. I mean, like, we're already on series four four of Skultimate Secrets. And we haven't even gotten to series four of the normal dolls. Let alone series two, even. Mm, I mean, we've gotten well, some of half series, of two. series two. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys liked this video, and if you didn't, go to my next video. And remember, like if you think it was the, um... Stitch Stim style, Frankie. Frankie, yep. And subscribe if you think it is the Cleo and Deuce two-pack of Valentine's Day. So, anyways, bye, guys. Wait, no, sorry, guys. Let me do this. Bye.